So it's a good 10 feet or so wide. This is a very wide ditch that they've trench that they put in. Almost like a French drain, uh, but it's uh, going straight instead of in a circle. You can see it is the the width of that vehicle there, almost entirely the width. So this is a very, very wide trench here. And it's only about maybe six to seven feet deep, maybe eight feet, probably six, seven feet, but it is very wide, maybe 10, 15 feet wide. This is a shot of the trench that they're building for the electrical coming down two miles from the build site up the road. This is the very furthest they've come so far and it's almost completely to the launch site. You can see we are right here at the almost at the curve in the road. May 21st, 2023. We got Starship, maybe 25 on pad B, as well as they just took the quick disconnect off of the launch tower. Once they get this, I believe they're bearing electrical. Once they get this electrical down to the launch site from the build site and possibly coming from Brownsville or maybe it's just from the solar farm that they have over there. They do have a large solar farm over at uh, by the satellite dish area and once they get this electrical over here maybe they'll bring it to this area at the base of the just where all that ready duct ready that red brick conduit brick they have there and uh, we will see possibly those large HVAC power generators get uh, sent back to where they came from. And maybe the launch site will be active again once they get the electrical here. Um, so that's the kind of the development so far. That's the update. So uh, I thought it was a really nice shot to get this. Uh, I will walk up a little closer and get that shot again.